I've been going to a lot of different cafes today to study because I realized that I actually work pretty well when I'm like sat down in a cafe and there's like nice music and nice ambiance and everything. So once again today, I'm probably gonna go to like a cafe. I haven't really decided where yet. I'm trying to do a thing where I go to a different cafe every, every time I go study. But obviously I can't go like every single day because my wallet kind of hurts. I've been having so many different types of matcha lattes from the, these cafes. I have a meeting in like 10 minutes, um, so I'm low-key kind of rushing, but it's with a friend, so I don't think she'll mind very much if I'm like cooking dinner in the middle of our meeting. Okay, I'm, I know you're supposed to like soak these in cold water first, but I completely forgot to do that this morning before I leave the house. I'm actually in the middle of making dinner right now. I hope you don't mind. It'll take like two more minutes. <laughs> okay, no. <laughs> Do you guys have like a heat wave or something? Here's today's dinner. It looks kind of messy because I already started eating like in the middle of when I was meeting my friend. But a few days ago, I made mala shangguo. 
is that how you say it? It's basically like spicy dry hot pot, kind of. Um, these are like all the leftovers I have now, so I just added like sweet potato noodles inside. And it's pretty good. The meeting with my friend took a lot less time than I thought. We only met for like 45 minutes, so. All right. I forgot to charge my iPad last night. I meant to go to another cafe today, but seeing as I'm literally at like 19%, I think I'm going to do some lectures at home first, and then once this charges up, I'll just head out. I hate working at home. It's so bad for me. I was originally planning to go down to Richmond to look for a cafe, but Richmond is so far and I don't really know any good study cafes that I can stay at for a long time. If you guys have any good like Richmond study spots or study cafes, let me know because I really want to start studying there. I know they have like good cafes and bomb drinks. this bag and I feel like it's in such a precarious position in there. I'm really scared. I stopped by Savon's on the way back home and I picked up these guys. Look how pretty they are! I'm like a sucker for colorful flowers and they're having a sale so I just picked up these guys and the stems are really really long like I'm gonna put these in a vase and my friend is coming to pick up some groceries later so I'm gonna meet with her then so I should probably get this done before she comes. Except my hands are really, really shaky now because I'm so tired. Like that. Wow, that was cut really badly. Hmm. 
I should probably cut them all at the same time so they're the same length. Oh my god, it's so pretty. This area is so pink now. Ta -da. I don't really know where I was going when I was making this, but I guess it's like a pork belly rice bowl. I feel like I spend over half my days just sitting down in front of a computer. I'm gonna see what my mom is up to. I feel like I haven't called her in a while. First bite. It's really hot, but it's really good. I realized today that my skin is like really, really textured, especially like my forehead area, except I've been like double cleansing every single day and I do have like a skincare routine that I follow. So I don't know why my skin is like this, but it's probably because it's been really hot recently, so... Ugh. My face feels really gross right now, so I'm just gonna take off my makeup. I tried calling my mom earlier, but she did seem pretty busy, so after I take my makeup off, I'm probably gonna call her back. We have some relatives visiting, so things have been very exciting in my household, and I'm getting lots and lots of FOMO, so I want to see what the updates are. My eyeliner was so good today. Well, it's off now. I'm never gonna be able to do eyeliner like this ever again. I don't really have any plans tomorrow, except I am going to wushu class again. I've been trying to get back into wushu because the past year, or like the past two years, I've kind of, I don't want to say lost my touch because I was never that great to begin with, but I haven't really been doing wushu all that much and I do want to focus on it this year, especially like the school year. And my friends and I are going to like this really good school right now and I am learning a lot from them so it's making me really motivated. <laughs> Boom! Haven't used these in a while. What's the shelf life of these? Oh, it doesn't say. I got these during Christmas, so I feel like I should use them up quickly because it's been what? Eight months? No, it's been six months. I'm not good at doing skincare, but it always feels really good afterwards, so it's very rewarding. Are you at Jiji's house? Yeah, is that you that's calling mom? Yeah. <laughs> Hello. 